ladies and gentlemen, distinguished guests, Bosconians, especially teachers and student researchers as well, and the judges who are invited today. Greetings through St. John Bosco dreams. I would like also to express my heartfelt gratitude and thanks to Father R.J. Undar for facilitating the invitation to speak to you today. I am delighted to be with you today to discuss an event of great significance, which is the inaugural on-site research colloquium hosted by Don Bosco Technical College, Cebu. Under the theme Exploring Innovation and Sustainable Solutions, Empowering Bosconians to Research, this event aims to foster a culture of innovation and sustainability among our students, encouraging them to engage in research and discovery and develop critical thinking, problem-solving skills, and creativity. Research has always been at the heart of academic institutions like yours, driving progress, and shaping the future. It is through research that we begin to gain a deeper understanding of the world around us, uncover new knowledge, and develop groundbreaking solutions to practical or complex problems. And at Don Bosco Technical College Cebu, the school firmly believes that research is not only a tool for academic growth, but also a means to empower our students to become agents of change. Our primary objective for this colloquium, ladies and gentlemen, is to provide a platform for our students to showcase their research projects and engage in meaningful discussions with their peers faculty members, and industry professionals. By doing so, we hope to instill in them the importance of research, critical thinking, and innovation as they navigate their academic and professional journeys. Who knows that your scientific career, which begins today, will be a critical predictor of your becoming a researcher in the future. We firmly believe, ladies and gentlemen, that by exploring innovation and sustainable solutions, our Bosconians will be equipped with the skills and knowledge needed to address the real world challenges they will inevitably face. Through their research endeavors, they will not only contribute to their communities but also make a positive impact on society as a whole. You know, the goal of research is for societal transformation. Useless ang research mo. Kung wala man lang ni isang kaluluwa, isang tao, isang pair, isang grupo, isang institusyon na lumuwag ang pananaw sa buhay, that they are able to see situations differently, armed with new discoveries. They're able to understand why things happen the way they do. And out of such complexity, they will be able to find better solutions through informed evidence-based actions. So, yon. As we embark on this exciting journey of exploration, let us remember the words of St. Bosco himself. Do your ordinary duties extraordinarily well. Through research, innovation, and sustainable solutions, we have the opportunity to go beyond the ordinary 
and create an extraordinary impact on the world around us. I would like to express my sincere gratitude to the organizing committee, the faculty members, and all the students who have worked tirelessly to make this event possible. Your dedication and commitment to academic excellence are truly commendable. In conclusion, let us embrace the spirit of exploration, innovation, and sustainability. Together, let us empower our Bosconians through research, enabling them to become the architects of a brighter future. May this colloquium be a stepping stone towards a world where innovation and sustainable solutions are at the front forefront of every endeavor. So my challenge to you today is, after this colloquium, convert your speeches into video recordings, upload it in YouTube, and then share that in your timeline so that it will become viral. And everybody else in Cebu, where you are located, will be able to listen to what is it that you want them to change for the better. Another one, make sure that you are able to present these studies in the halls of the meetings of the communities where your discovery will be important to guide, to guide, you know, the development path of your people. Thank you very much for this opportunity. Okay, good morning.